going the distance. Corner route. Corner Bellman. route. Corner Bellman. route. Looking for Connor Landberg. He's got him wide open at the 30. 25-20. Forget about it. Touchdown. First play of the second half, and I don't see a penalty marker anywhere. And just like that, they extend their lead. Three plays, 21 big points for the Laguna Hills Hawks. A 63-yard touchdown scoring strike to Connor Landberg. I don't know if we have this on replay, but Connor Landberg ran a gorgeous two-break route. And I want you to watch Alex Solera with a key block. But you can see he started the out move and then snapped it up the field and both the corner and the safety, and I would have too. They bought that out move. And Connor Landberg with a really terrific route and a nice throw by Tim. Seven minutes remaining here in the second quarter. Bellman. And he's got his man coming back to the football. Nice textbook catch there by Connor Landberg, the 6'3", 170 pound free safety wide receiver, quarterback, one of those slash players. Let coach. me, let me tell you. Three slashes. I was talking to Tim Miltenberger watching this guy play catch with Bellman before the game. Holy cow, does he have a great arm? And, and they said, well, yeah, he plays. Everything else, he does some wide receiver. He, he's look a little at this, bit of a look safety. Look at this form, coach, and the release. Beautiful Quick snap throw. throw. Beautiful tight spiral. Very catchable receiver and quarterback on the catch the ball. And run after the catch. It's first down for Laguna Hills and Bellman back to throw. Fires and it's caught. Pass is caught. Number 20, Connor Landberg. Landberg, the 6'3", 170-pound junior. He's got about six on the play down to the 27-yard line. It'll be second down and four. Out that defensive front. Third and 22 for Bellman, and he fires on the out pattern. The pass. Tennis team, those, those young ladies are unbelievable athletes. Three-step game, short pass. And I tell you, this guy's putting on a show tonight. It's a good throw by Bellman, but I'm so impressed with Connor Landberg. He will probably be the quarterback next year. And, you know, there was a pretty good combination like that quite a few years ago at El Toro High School. Ryan, you're in motion. Bellman's going to be pressured from the backside, able to get rid of it. And Connor Landberg is going to pick up the first. Uh, they're going to mark it, I think, just shy of the first down yard mark. They get a. This game just shy of a five yard average. Play action, Christie looking over the middle, another one is picked off. Connor Landberg's got the football. I'll and tell you what. And Landberg just got right into the passing lane. I don't know what uh, Christie was looking at, but Landberg was right there. That is his first, inter second interception rather of the uh, 2010 season. I don't think that Zach Christie ever saw Connor Landberg. He kind of a little sneaky in his coverage. When you watch this, see if you can see what Christie's looking at. There's the ball fake. He sees the vertical, but, whoa, oh boy, from where Landberg came from, uh, that's just a great, this, this guy's a terrific athlete. Not only did he make the interception, but he got the ball back all the way out to the 25-yard. Looking down and 10, the ball on the 12-yard line. Perriman singled. They're going to go after him right here. Perriman looking, looking, and this one 
Almost intercepted Connor Landberg there defensively, number 20. And Ackermite winds and throws, deals into the end zone. And it's broken up, and that's going to bring up fourth down. What a great effort by Will Ackermite to extend the play. You hear that term used a lot in the NFL and in college football, a quarterback who has the ability to kind of run around and stay out of trouble long enough for somebody to get open. It's just that uh, pretty good coverage play back there by number 20, Connor Landberg. Connor's had himself quite a night tonight, too. Here comes the inside handoff. Bragg down to the five-yard line. Connor Landberg there to make the stop defensively for Laguna Hills. Yeah. 